It's always great to see our friend Jen John Meyer of Alamo Draft House. Hello. And we love when she brings along friends that we know and love, like Malia Spencer from The Kitchen. Uh, Good to see you. It's so great to it's be here. It's been a hot second, hasn't it? Just a little bit. A lot's been going on. Well, you're as gorgeous as ever. Just you're so, you know, so kind. You really Thank have. you. So let's first dive into Alamo, Miss Jen. I mean, yeah. it is like, wow. Yes. Busy, uh, busy. So busy, busy, finally. Um, it's been, you know, this is our slow season, but we finally got Dune Part 2 coming. Uh, we are celebrating by wearing our sand-colored clothing. <sighs> Um, we did not get the memo. As, as you can imagine. Yeah. Well, you're kind of. Ish. <laughs> so I don't know if you've seen the reviews for this, but uh, they include things like the best sci-fi movie ever, a masterpiece, a lot of sand. Nobody said, I don't think anybody said a lot of sand. <laughs> <laughs> like, two of those three are real reviews that I read. So I'm very excited to see it. And we have um, a couple things happening. We have some limited edition pint glasses. I love our pint glasses. Mm -hmm. My cabinets are stocked with them. And then we also have a dune menu. So we'll have our spiced popcorn, and we have this desert dip that's this really amazing oh, hummus. Oh, Yes. With oh, the Jen, can I tell you, though, Dune, uh, so last Tuesday, they had a screening of Dune for my fellow Critics' Choice movie members. Yes. Like in, I think in New York and L.A. I think I was telling Maddie about this. Mm -hmm. They all loved it. Yeah. They loved Everybody's it. saying it's, which I was not expecting, honestly. Yeah. Like, I was like. Because the first one didn't really come out to much like right. a claim, right? It right. was kind of like, okay. And it was kind of a bad time. It was like 2021, and everybody's like, are we doing movies again? What's yeah. going on, you know? So okay. we're a lot working against it, but part two, I'm actually excited to see, and it's not really my genre. Yeah. So, not me either. Yeah. Okay, so, anyway. I want to hop back, though. You said the limited menu. You said a dune dip. You said yeah. like a hummus. A desert dip, yeah. A desert it's dip, this sorry. Incredible hummus. It is so good. And then we have these cucumber sticks that we serve with it, which I want us to have cucumber sticks on the menu all the time. I'm like, can we just yeah. have those in lieu of chips for Please. the yeah. like, gluten free people like myself? Oh. Yes. Yeah. But yeah. So oh good. Gosh, and then, did I see and chicken? Some, yes, some chicken wings. Ornithopter. I can't, I'm sure I'm pronouncing it. Oh my gosh. Wings. I'm That's sorry, I heard of Oppenheimer. No, right. no, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Made with real Last ornithopter. Year. Last year. Last year, man. Yeah. Gotta move right. forward. Right. Um, so. You also have Charity on Tap. Yes, happening. we have Charity mm -hmm. on Tap happening, and I love that we have the kitchen yeah. for our, actually we've already started it. We didn't have an official one for February, so we started early with the kitchen. Perfect. And that will go through March, and we've partnered with Logboat Brewing. So for every pint sold of Logboat, we donate a dollar to the kitchen. And we're just gonna have a couple of fun parties in mm -hmm. March as well at the back lot with the kitchen. Just yes. any reason we can have to celebrate, drink beer, donate money, mm -hmm. and just, you know, bring a bigger spotlight to everything you guys are doing. Well, we appreciate you guys, that. Tell everybody yeah. about the kitchen and your yeah. mission and what you do. Yeah, so this year, actually on March 27th, we'll be celebrating 41 years ah. of serving our community. And in 2023, we served 711 people by housing them. And then we served another 639 folks over at our rare breed, so our youth over there. Mm -hmm. So that's 1,300 lives impacted mm -hmm. at the kitchen because of partnerships like the back lot at Alamo Draft House because we couldn't do it without these these great partners to be able to bring um, not just shelter but a pathway to hope and stability and purpose for the folks who really need it most. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah. How many years again you said? 41. 41, 41. Wow. since wow. Sister Lorraine started the kitchen. Yes. Wow. Yeah. So much fun. Yeah. And so, I'm yeah. glad that you can help out. Yeah. yeah. What has been your favorite part of this collaboration with Alamo and vice versa? Well, I, you know, I think Sister would be okay for me saying this, even though she's up in heaven now. But I do enjoy a good beer every once in a while. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right? And so I'm very excited about that. Yeah. Um, having a cold one with friends and mm -hmm. being able to celebrate all the great partners and just what a great community we have. That's the fun part about yeah. doing these types of partnerships. You know. And you're, a, helping. Yes. you're helping. You're helping. Right. Great organization. So right. it's like Absolutely. having a beer, helping the out. The more you drink, the yeah. more you're giving back. Right. I, I love that. I love <laughs> that. Yeah. How can people help the kitchen? Like everyday people yeah. out there watching, how can they just you know, support and, and donate maybe? If they yes. don't drink beer. Yeah, if, if they, they don't, don't drink yeah. beer. Yeah, for like my mom watching who doesn't. And so um, how she can still help and uh, like other viewers can is, number one, go to our website. And we at thekitcheninc.org and we have a volunteer tab and we'll talk about a multitude of ways that you can get involved. Um, some of those might be preparing a meal and providing it for our youth over at Rare Breed. It could be helping uh, organize our donation center or spring is coming and 
And if you're doing a little bit of spring cleaning, mm -hmm. you can donate some of those items at the kitchen. I say think about when you moved into your first apartment, whether it was kitchenware or linens or anything like that. We gladly take those over at the kitchen on 730 North Glenstone and we'll be able to repurpose those for folks who are starting over in life. Malia, awesome. you just yeah. sang music to my ears because I am getting rid of so much stuff. I just moved and I'm oh. like, why do I have so much stuff? Yes. So I'll be coming to the kitchen with bags of clothes. Thank yes. you. We will gladly take them <laughs> and put them to good use. I know, we were right? We just talking yes. about yeah. this. I was str we were stressed out. Yeah. And I was like, this is a God thing right here. That yes. Here. That's uh, perfect. Sister. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And right. sister, if you're watching. God it was all you. her. Uh, and one more time, tell us about everything at the Alamo, the back lot, all through March, supporting the kitchen. Right. And um, then the new menu starts. Is it already started for Dune? The menu starts, what is today? The 27th. starts yeah. the 29th. 29th. Okay. On yeah. Thursday. Leap day. Thursday. Leap day. Right. Leap day. Leap day, guys. Also, happy birthday. Oh, thank you. You're yes, so sweet. Yes, happy stop looking birthday. at this cake, cake so I don't amazing. even know Well, you can I take a big old piece segment. home oh, if you'd like. <laughs> You're more than welcome to. And by the way, too, um, we are playing my favorite game next called Time Pieces. If you'd like to stay and play Ooh. with us. Do you have time? Do you have time? And if you don't, that's okay. I have time. I just want to know what time pieces are all we'll about. We'll explain it. Okay. <laughs> we'll explain it in the commercial, but stick around. Okay. And go see all your favorite movies at Alamo Draft House Please and do. have some great food. Yes. All right, you guys, the fun is obviously going to continue right here on Ozark's Fox AM after this. It's like, I love, I, I.